is Dr. Donna. Welcome to week 34. Last week, we read how to think like Steve Jobs. Wouldn't it be amazing if everybody in the entire world could think like Steve Jobs, or at least some of us? Well, I'm one of those people, and for those of you who read, you're one of those people too, and we wanted to think like Steve Jobs. The book was filled with so many nuggets, and really, stories about Steve Jobs that I hadn't heard yet. What amazed me the most was that they referred to him as the Thomas Edison of our lifetime, and I thought that that was apropos because he actually changed the game for computers, for music, for animated movies. So many different areas of the industry have been impacted and our lives are a lot better. Don't you just love Apple TV? I know I do. The part that resonated the most with me was the fact that Steve Jobs believed in stealing ideas. He really did. He thought it was great. Why reinvent the wheel? Why not take something that's already in existence and simply make it better? And isn't that what he did with the PC and with animated movies and, of course, with the music industry, 1,000 songs right there in your pocket? You got to love the iPod. It's all about how original thinkers actually think. What was amazing was I didn't even know this when we picked this last week, but original thinkers also take great ideas and they improve upon them. So instead of sitting in your lab and thinking about how am I going to reinvent or make something new, all you have to do is focus on how to make something better. Find your passion and then take a look around and see what other people in your industry are doing and then make it better. This week it's from Pat Riley. It's called The Winner Within. Pat Riley has had an amazing career in basketball, and he's going to teach us how to win and how to create a winning team. And that's what it's all about, being a part of a winning team so that you can wake up every day and win. The TED Talk this week is called, After Watching This, Your Brain Will Never Be the Same. That is amazing, and I can't wait to see how my brain is going to transform. It is plastic after all. For those of you who are just now joining us, you go ahead and you click on that link below and you sign up because you want to be better than average and you want to read more than one nonfiction book a year. And as I always say, when you can see it and you can read it, then you can believe it and you can achieve it from here to the galaxy sphere. I'll see you guys next week. Au revoir.